Thank you for joining me for yet another unboxing video. Today we have the game Punsanity. Food Fighters vs. Party Animals. This was another budget store find. I got this for $2.99 and 50% off. Picked it up because I, I know it's a little card game. Fun to bring in the car to go for on a quick ride or bring it on vacation. Let's see what we got here. Food Fighters vs. Party Animals. Defend your troops and destroy your enemies in this brand new best-selling expandable card game. Play as the leader of a zany army and fight to preserve your dignity before it's too late. It's for two players. Lasts about, oh, what's it say there? About 20 minutes. And it's for ages 10 plus. Brought to you by Dreamscape Games. It was released in 2020. Contains 90 cards and one rule booklet. Again, for $2.99 and 50% off. I said, you can't go wrong. Let me check it out. As you guys know, I have two young, relatively young children. I have an eight-year-old, eight soon to be nine. And then we have a 13-year-old who's going on 45. But they still like to play games with their old man when they have time. And uh, this looks like a fun, quick, easy game to play. So, like I said, I picked it up for a budget budget price so why not oh i like that how the box opens like that that's cool got some cool artwork on the inside and then it says here pun sanity foo fighters or party animals so it says here how to win reduce the enemy commander's health to zero to win the game or if you or your enemy run out of cards in your main deck take 15 random cards from your trash pile to form a new one you lose if you draw all these cards without destroying the enemy commander. There are four factions in Punsanity. Food fighters, party animals, mech dweller, and battle mages. Card types that you get there. Commander, fighter, item, pun, inside joke, building, legendary. The layout of the card. The setup. Start the game. Draw phase, start of turn phase, action phase, end of turn phase, attacking, keywords, and thanks for playing. Learn more at punsanity.com backslash play. Need more information about the game? Excellent, excellent, excellent. And inside here, you get yourself two decks of cards. So let's take a look at these. So we're going to take a look at the first one here. It says side deck and we have the commander we got the side deck oh so we got the side deck we've got a building let's put a rule book out here i'm gonna have to pick this up just a little bit so we can see more about this punch sanity We got a lot of those kind of cards. All right, so, and then over here, we've got a thank you card. That's really cool. Let's see what it says here on this thank you card. It says, Punsani, uh, Mech Dwellers vs. Battle Mages. The adventure continues. Uh, it's a, uh, go to punsanity.com. It's an expand, another expansion you can get for this card game if you wanted to. And it says, thank you for purchasing Punsanity. Dear cousin, we want to take a moment to thank you for purchasing Punsanity. Your feedback is important to us. We would really appreciate a product review. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to tell us. Contact us here at support at punsanity.com. All right, awesome. So we're not doing a, uh, we're not giving them a uh, review, but we're doing an unboxing video. So we're glad to have you guys aboard. Not thank me, but thank you as well. So there you go. That's a really cool card. I like that when you find stuff like that in different uh, games where they actually say thank you to the person who bought it. So we got building deck here. So they are cards, I should say. So it says Disco Treehouse. Disco Treehouse. Disco Treehouse. All right. Looks like it's, they look like they're all the same. So it says Disco Treehouse. It says we're open 25 slash 8 and we're fine. At the start of your turn, gain one treat. All right. So you get a bunch of those cards. Those are your building cards. You also get what we call a side deck, it says. Only four of those cards. That's what it says. All of them are the same. It says cat token. 
what would uh, Cat would get lonely if it weren't for his followers on Clawbook? Cat tokens, there you go. Then we have the Punsanity deck. All bands on deck, I mean all feet on stage. Rhythm, deal two damage to a fighter. If damage destroys it, put the fighter on top of its owner's deck or in their hand. Get three points for doing that. Okay, big musician. Puma the Tiny, offering to Cat, blessings of Cat, blessings of Cat, Boombox, let's see what it says here, a must-have for disc and deck jockeys, deal one damage to all enemy fighters, rhythm, do it again, beat that drum, Catastrophe, beats and cats, kitty strike force, cut a ball, catapult, Metrodome, Cat Party Boss, Giant Cat. When he steps on a house, he says, Me, ow! This card is treated as a cat token while on the battlefield. Gets four points for that. Uh, Break Dancer, Crazy Cat Lady, Party Pooper, Micro DJ. So that's what you find in your Pun Sanity deck. Then we've got the other deck. Commander, side deck, more building cards, and more Pun Sanity deck cards. Yep. So we got a lot of those. Oh, then we got also have another commander card and the side deck card. So we'll put those all together. So let's start again with the building deck. Start with that. Building. Getting all the backs are the same. Let's take a look at the fronts. Apple tree. You've never seen a tree with a face before? At the turn, start of your turn, gain one sugar. So apple tree. These are all the same. All right. We'll do the side deck also. So we got two of those. The legendary dragon fruit. He eats fighters like you for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. This card has thorns. So looks like you get nine sugar cubes for that. Cat token. Cat would get lonely if it weren't for his followers on Clawbook. Again, they go side deck. Then we have a couple of commander cards. The Grape Commander. Passive ability. Whenever you remove all the damage from a friendly fighter, increase its health by two. Play two sugars. Remove two damage from a friendly fighter. On the bottom it says there, it says start, minimum, and maximum. And they have DJ Cats. Passive ability. Both players draw a card every time you play a card with rhythm. Play two treats. Summon a cat token. Again, start. Minimal and max. I guess those are the two commanders that you're playing in this game. And then we've got the Pun Sanity deck as well again. So again, we have sharing size. Food fighters have to eat something after their party. Restore two health to all friendly fighters. We've got Pomegranate Shield, Straw Burry. Heel Bomb, Cherry Bomb, Food Slice, Family Tree, Patched Patched Pumpkin Patch, Grapevine, Don't Be Such, uh, Don't Be a Bunch of Sour Grapes, Cheer Up, at the end of your turn, remove two damage from a friendly character, Strawberry Tall Cake, ABC Soup, Pound Cake, Dragon Fruit Egg, Napoleon Bone Appetit, El Gori Guacamole, Pineapple, Bean Mage. Let's see what Bean Mage says. I cast Laser Bean. Pay 10 sugar, deal 10 damage to all enemies, then sacrifice this card. So there you go. So that's everything that's included. 
and that concludes this unboxing of Punsandi, Food Fighters vs. Party Animals. There you go. Again, this game is for two players, lasts about 20 minutes, and it's for ages 10 plus. As always, thank you so much for joining us for this unboxing video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, you could always give us a thumbs up and leave a comment below. You could also hit that subscribe button. This way you're kept up to date as to any time we release any new content to the page. As always, thank you so much for joining us. Be safe, be well, enjoy the rest of your day, and we'll catch you on the next unboxing video.